Lucking friends, and welcome to the first ever episode of the 100 Baby Gems. This is my official founder, Gemma Gemstone. She is um, a cute sim that I've made. I'm sure I have posted by this point. Um, so if you haven't, you can check out that video. I'll have a link in the description as well as a card. And then this lovely lady is her wife, Star Garnet Jewel. And she was made by Amber, who is Simber Sanders on YouTube. She's awesome. You should definitely go check out her channel. I'll have a link in the description to her as well. But she so kindly made me a um, beautiful uh, star here to be Gemma's wife. And they are going to be the founders of my 100 Berry Baby Challenge. So I'm going to go ahead and talk to you guys a little bit as I furnish their house. So I also did a speed build video where I built this packed tiny home. So it's supposed to be, a, it is a tiny home in theory, obviously looking at it, it's clearly not. So we're gonna get some um, benefits from that. But they only have 5,900 simoleons to spend and they have nothing right now. So that will be interesting for sure. You know what, I changed my mind. I'm not gonna furnish anything because they live in Evergreen Harbor, as you can tell, and so I'm gonna have them go dig in some dumpsters and see what I can find there to help save a little bit of money. So yeah, with the 100 Berry Baby Challenge, basically the goal is to have 100 babies over 10 generations. So each generation is gonna have 10 babies, and I'm only gonna, at least for the first generation, have one spouse. You can kind of modify that as you want, but I'm not gonna do 10 different spouses. It's just gonna be one for this particular family. I'm not gonna do any money cheats So I didn't find any dumpsters just in the world. So I had them come to this lot here and of course the um, Dumpster is empty, but you know what this is a hundred berry baby challenge although I'm realizing I need to uh, Modify their genetics so that they can get each other pregnant. So let me do that real quick and let's go try for a baby. I realize I probably should have them try on their home lot because they um, have the ley line trait there, but that's okay. This is a sort of a, um, well, not really a rags to riches, but it definitely, you know, they're starting out in Evergreen Harbor. Did you get caught on the bush, Gemma? Oh, that girl is messing with your woohoo spot, ladies. How rude. Um, but anyway, what I was saying is, you know, I feel like ah, let's kick off this 100 baby challenge with a woohoo in the dumpster because <laughs> why not? Sounds like a great start. I was so shocked when my sims did this in my other challenge. Um, I was not expecting dive for, for thrills because I wasn't clicking on the dumpster. It was just an interaction with the other sim. I didn't realize that meant go woohoo in a dumpster. Woohoo! Nice job, ladies. That's good. Keep your legs up, Gemma. <laughs> Let it really sink in. <laughs> uh, oh. Job well done, ladies job well done all right I didn't find anything in that spot so they went to the uh, uh, smoggy part of town but that glow is almost kind of pretty I thought that was a dumpster but apparently not um, but I'm sure there is a dumpster back here let's go ahead and dive for deals so I'm gonna go ahead and have star get a job because we're gonna need some money and she is allowed to go to have a job because she is the spouse I think I want her to work in the um, civil engineering track I think that's what it's called civil designer so um, I'm not quite sure yet if I'll have her go down the green technician or the civic planner route but that's gonna be her career so she will start tomorrow at 9 a.m. Oh, that's awesome ooh choir recycled materials of course miss Gemma what has you thinking about babies and holding your stomach are you pregnant girl already are we off to that awesome of a start um, so yeah go ahead and die for deals sort out recyclables maybe no don't let this guy into your dumpster guard your dumpster ladies did she find anything by the way an eco upgrade part 
Awesome. How about some furniture? <laughs> um, dive for deals. Stop talking. I wish they could like both dive in the dumpster at the same time. Like, can you imagine just both their legs hanging over the sides? <sighs> okay, dive for deals. Oh, nice. She found a sleeper single bed. We could definitely maybe try to restore that. We'll need beds for our children. <laughs> so Star found a cabinet. Okay. Um, cool. Nice! Star found some recycled materials, so that's excellent because that was what she needed to do for work and she got a little bit of money, so that is all great. And it looks like she... The dumpster must have been a wishing well in a previous life. Star got it recovered $2 from Dirty Pile Depths. <laughs> nice! Alright, empty? Alright, well then ladies, let's go home and see about furnishing your house. We <laughs> really didn't find too much. We did get this bed which I'm just gonna throw in one of the bedrooms for now. Let's put it in here, I guess. I don't know. We'll just put it there for now. And then we got this random cabinet, which we'll just stick over here. All right, so Let's see, we'll definitely need a bed for them. Let's go with this one, I think, and we'll do... <laughs> I uh, haven't gotten the recolors yet to be able to exactly match their coloring, so I'm just gonna do my best. Let's do that one there. And I feel like we definitely need the bathroom stuff, so let's go ahead and add that in. the basic, basic necessities. All right, so we got a bathroom set up going and we'll definitely need some stuff for the kitchen. I'm realizing this house doesn't have the best area for a kitchen because the windows are so low. So that will be interesting. We're just gonna go for the cheapest uh, oven at this point. We'll give them a nicer one when I feel like I can trust that they're not gonna just burn it. So I have no idea what I'm doing in terms of furnishing this house at this point. So we're just gonna throw some stuff in here and I'll figure out the window situation later. Give them a kitchen seat. All right, so that leaves them with $3,000, but let's see, we're gonna need some kids stuff. So let's go ahead and give them a baby bassinet. And, okay, so we have the bathroom, the kitchen, the bed. We could use some uh, things for learning. <laughs> the learning things, and probably something for fun, but we'll see. We can just have them woohoo for fun, right? So how much does the maker station cost? Is that gonna be out of our budget? Or the fabricator, that is. Um, so technically we can afford a home fabricator but I'm not sure if we should buy one just yet I'm definitely gonna buy an easel and we're just we're just gonna stick that over here well we'll save it we don't have to spend all our money right now how much does it cost to replace that that's a lot of money we might just put that back in our inventory but it, we'll keep it for now all right Star, come take a shower, hun. Doing pretty good. Let's go ahead and have you come make a classic painting. Start working on that skill point. Then someone's gonna have to make us some food. So the nice thing about living in this packed tiny home is that they're gonna be able to get a nice boost in their skills. 
And honestly, I feel like the shading in the house isn't that bad, but maybe it's because I did a lot of black stuff. Did you finish your painting? Oh, I guess you did. Okay, please don't burn down the house. Please don't burn down the house. And did you make just food for yourself or did you make some for your wife too? We should definitely get them like a table or something. Aww, so sweet. Can you sell our painting? Oh, uh, come and <laughs> come admire your wife's artwork. Look at those dogs and maybe a cat. Isn't that something special? What do you think of it? Because she is an art lover, so. <laughs> oh, is it like the... I guess I never really stuck around for the meeting your neighbors thing. I think that's Pippa. Her outfit is super cute. You definitely need to give her a friendly introduction. Gossip about your neighbors with your neighbor. Can I recolor this? Perfect. Oh, she's thinking about babies again. Don't you worry, Gemma, we will have you. Oh, you just went to the bathroom. I should have had you take a pregnancy test, but we will do that. Don't you worry. Star Garnet's just out here making friends with the neighbors. Such a friendly gal. All right, well, time for you to come pee on a stick. There she is. She's pregnant. Yay, she's eating for two. Let's check out her cute little baby bump. Oh, already coming in, super cute. That's like my favorite part about pregnant sims is their little baby bump. Oh, I totally missed that, sorry you guys, but she just told um, Star the good news that they're pregnant and expecting. Reveal the deep secret. Go ahead and hug lovingly. So they must have a dumpster around somewhere because they have the, um, oh, definitely become best friends. They have that woohoo option. Aww. Go ahead and give her a friendly introduction. You guys can be best of friends. Hey, you guys have similar coloring. You'd almost think that mint green was my favorite color. <laughs> Pippa. Guess what? We're pregnant. Oh, definitely brag about your really tidy home. <laughs> Clearly, this is the smallest tidy home you will have ever seen. Come vote on some neighborhood action plans. All right, so let's see. We'll be rewarded with influence for owning functional clean energy producing objects, solar panels, wind turbines, and dew collectors. I definitely like that, but I think let's go for green gardening because they won't have money for that stuff for a little while. So speaking of which, let's go. <laughs> maybe start working on our gardening skill. So let's get some starter vegetables and starter fruits. Go ahead and open those seed packets up. What do we have? That's a winter, fall and spring, plant plantains, and fall. <laughs> Lovely. Um, why not? Let's grow a plantain tree. A couple plantain trees. So I kind of want them to do one more dumpster, uh, <laughs> dumpster dive. So I'm gonna have them dive for thrills so I can just follow them and figure out where the dumpster is. Are you ready for round two? Let's make it twins! Gemma's in. All right, and we'll follow them. Apparently, Star is running there. Oh, okay, cool. So it's in this little area. And there's this like little mini park area here too. Okay, good to know. So, like, off that corner there, right there. Cool. Now I know. Oh, so gross, but very cute. <laughs> nice job. Oh, she's so dirty. Well, <laughs> who should I have do what? I guess she has work in the morning, so <laughs> let's have the pregnant lady die for deals. And Jewel, or sorry, Star, you're gonna come sleep in a nice comfy bed. Besides, you're already filthy there, Gemma. What's a little more trash 
diving gonna do for you? Oh, she found a nice bathtub. We'll need one of those for toddlers. What else did you find? Oh, I guess this was the dumpster to have her come dive in. She got way better things in this dumpster than the one at the other lot. Let's go ahead and do that one. And then, how does this bed's energy dirty double? Okay, so it's definitely not a very good bed. So we're gonna go ahead and just sell it. Oh, it's only worth 25 bucks. Maybe we should just recycle it and get some recyclable parts from it. That would be better. Oh, it's broken. We'll fix it but not right now. Alrighty, so it looks like Star has work in an hour. So let's have her, what is she gonna do? No, you have, your wife made some yummy eggs and toast yesterday or last night, a late snack. She was hungry, so come have that before you go to work. Oh, and I want you to go to work. And then my goal for Gemma today would be to fix the shower tub thing. It's taking them so long to shower in this shower. I swear it takes them like two hours. So I'm hoping this one will be better. All right, this cutie pie is off to work in her hard hat. I <laughs> love it. Have fun at work, Star. All right, our pregnant mama is away. Let's have her come go to the bathroom and eat some food. Seems like Pippa just comes over all the time. Apparently just walks in. Oh, I bet because this is technically outside, they can just come right in. <laughs> oh, well, I don't know, I don't mind. We'll see. All right, come repair that. <laughs> Pippa's just gonna talk to her while she fixes the bathtub. Yay, she fixed it. Oh, that'll be wonderful. Okay, how are our little plants coming? Can I get some summer seeds? Mm, we can only get them at level five. Okay. Okay, is there anything? Is she home? Yay, Star's home. Good job, girl. Come take a nice bubble bath in your new... Is it dirty? It looks really clean. Is it clean? Wow, they got it out of the dumpster and didn't even need to clean it first. Okay, come take a nice bubble bath and you come dive for deals. We found some recyclable materials. Uh, okay, she found a rundown table. She might, oh, just the general thing. Why don't you do a playful painting? What did she find? Ooh, she found a toilet, nice. Okay, keep on digging. Your neighbors throw out some nice stuff in this dumpster. A sink? We are on the roll. 11 bucks? Cool. Uh, maybe just more recyclable materials? No worries. You'll shower. Inventory for... Uh, okay. Looks like she is solid. So come take a shower. Did you finish your playful painting? <laughs> oh, I kind of love it. I almost want to put it in the kids' room. But... We're going to go ahead and sell to a collector. Clearly you're gonna, a collector is going to go nuts for that. Alright, let's go ahead and make something. Let's make some grilled cheese. So, okay, we have this awesome sink that we will put in here for now. And then we have this toilet that we can there and ooh, that's a nice little table how much do we have to pay to replace that why not that's a cute one and then we can probably recolor it it's like berry colored you know like ooh, that's a nice one okay what are my that's kind of cute I like that it incorporates both their colors. Great find. Okay, I'm curious how much that cost normally. 
Oh, I feel like it's the same cost. I thought it was cheaper if you just were replacing it without like having to completely buy it. Well, I think when she gets high enough up in her career, don't play in that. Why don't you scavenge for parts? <laughs> Gemma does not look pleased. But yet she's flirty, funny girl. All right, come use the bathroom and eat some food. And what are you doing? Oh, you also have to pee. Did you just cut your pregnant wife off to the bathroom? That's rude. Okay, go ahead and work on repairing that. Okay, so if it's gonna end up costing about the same money. I wanna see how much the chairs would be. Or any chairs, really. They don't have to be the matching ones. 130, I feel like. Oh, there's also this one. These are so fun. We're gonna do two of those on opposite ends for now. <laughs> Just eating her grilled cheese sandwich while Star fixes the sink, chatting about life. Oh girl, hurry up and finish your food so you can pee. All that running water is probably making it worse. Nice job, Star, nice job. Go ahead and clean it up. Just enjoying their grilled cheese sandwiches together. How, how's the baby come along? Okay, so her third trimester, she's in her second, will be soon though. All right, I was really hoping that we could have the first baby in the first episode, but I don't think that's gonna happen. But definitely next episode, Gemma will have the first baby, our first baby gemstone, which is super exciting. So thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this, please give it a thumbs up and maybe consider subscribing. Happy simming!